I'll introduce you to this course I've been working on. I've just released it and I wanted to give a lot of you guys who have subscribed and follow me on Medium or Twitter, I wanted to give you guys a chance to get this course for free. So for the next three days it is it is completely free, you just use this code. But I just want to talk very quickly about what it actually covers. Now obviously you can see from the title it's NLP and it's with Transformers and Python. Now if we scroll down a little bit we come to this course overview video and I'll just quickly you know go through this because it's quite long and I don't want to take too much time too much of your time and we cover a lot of things so first thing is NLP and Transformers where I give a quick summary of NLP in general the history of NLP leading up to Transformers and then move into a bit of pre-processing for NLP now this is just your, your basic stuff I think the most relevant one here for us and Transformers is Unicode normalization and tokenization of special tokens. Then I move through a few lectures on attention, how attention works and describing the logic behind it for moving into what I, I always see this as like the, the hello world of NLP, which is sentiment analysis. I think it's a a great introduction and we introduce transformers in this section here and it's worth pointing out as well that i use a lot of different frameworks throughout this course so flare is the, the very first one we also we use hockey face transformers that's the, obviously the primary one that we'll be using throughout the course tensorflow pytorch nltk Spacey and and many others as well. So there's a lot in there. Of course, using a lot of BERT. And then there's a few, so there's two projects in the course as well. The first of those is sentiment analysis. The second one is question answering. Both of them I think are great because they take you all the way through from the very start of your project, so getting data, all the way through to actually building your model and applying it to your data. Then we moved on to named entity recognition, question answering, how we measure the performance of our models, which is of course very important. A full question answering stack using some another library called Haystack, which I think this is one of the coolest things in the course in my opinion. And it just in general in NLP in general, this sort of stuff is incredibly cool. Then, like I said, there's that second project, the, the Q&A project. Before we move on to similarity, now similarity is super important in NLP and I think probably one of the most promising areas uh, in the future for further research and just impact that it could have on industry. I think this is really a super cool place to be. And then finally, we move on to fine tuning. So that's the course in a nutshell. Altogether, there's 11 hours of content. So it's, I think, comparatively long when you look at other NLP courses. So you know, we see this 11, 10, 10, 3, and 6. And as far as I'm aware, it's a first course that focuses on Transformers on Udemy. So if you're into NLP, obviously Transformers are really the models that you want to be using. You know, Check out the course in the next three days. It's completely free using this code. So thank you for watching and I hope you enjoy the course.